Joining us here today to talk a little bit more about this, Croc culinary arts student Karime Soto and Heather McFarland from the Salvation Army. Thanks so much for coming on. We appreciate it. And, you know, you, you've already won our hearts. Yeah, all the donuts. Some donuts. <laughs> and we just learned the original recipe has been tweaked over the years, but there's actually official donut Lassie recipe. So can those be replicated at home? They sure can. I think the only thing that probably has changed is how many of us actually cook with lard these days. Right. <laughs> so that's one thing. We had a lot of fun with Courtney the other day and being able to make the donuts at the Croc Culinary Arts Program at the mm -hmm. Salvation Army over in Dorchester. And um, across the state today, we actually, not only our culinary arts students have been making and decorating donuts, but some of the kids in our after school programs and across the whole state will be getting to partake in the fun like you too. So. Love that. So what constitutes a donut? Uh, it is a mixture of um, um, it, is, it is a mixture of the ingredients that we um, when we so there's flour there's yep. sorry, egg yes. that's okay I was gonna say that recipe because it is so old you gotta think about how <laughs> yeah. it's changed over the years but that's where legitimately years ago when before we had the modern day donut on the front lines of World War One. There were donut lassies actually taking the flour in the lard in the oil, and they were mm. called oily cakes, like you heard the chef say. And they were taking them and frying them right out of the soldier's helmet. So we're, today we're going to try to decorate some. Yep. So can you share some tips for decorating? Sort of what's important when you're decorating a donut? Yes, of course. Ooh. We can put the gloves. Put some gloves on. Yes, please. So when we grab the donut, all right, gotta put the gloves. Okay. Yes. Yep. You got it. Use whatever you glaze you decide. Okay. So you dip the donut, you just put it there. Turn it, yep, mm -hmm. dip it in the frosting exactly. or glaze. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna go just chocolate, I think. Yeah, me too. Right, right in the tray. And then you put it in the tray. Uh -huh. That's not enough. There we go. Yeah, come on, let's <laughs> yep. get this thing nice and... Okay. Yeah. There we go, yeah. So there we go. And then you just cover it with whatever? That's yes, so easy. of course. They're like a beautiful oh, look at stuff. This. You can create some, some of them. What a fun thing there we go. to do. Now, how can people get involved? People can in, get involved uh, in, I'm as a student, as a student who graduated in uh, April this year, I graduated actually with my son, so I'm so proud and, you know, uh, we are creating a business. So the, uh, I'm so thankful to the Salvation Army. This is uh, such a great opportunity that they provide to the community. They welcome us. They hug us, they uh, teach us everything that we have to be in the safe way to cook uh, chicken, fish, uh, also, you know, to, we got the safe certification. So it is infinity of opportunities that they mm. brought to us. So we I'm love so it. thankful. Thanks, guys. Thanks. Go to the website. Go to the website. We'll have more information well. on our website, wbztv.com.